Okay, this is Chit Chat number two. So, as I said in the first video, I wasn't having the best of days, and I haven't been. And, um, yeah, I got some videos shy, so that was about the highlight of my day. But early today, I kind of went off, though. And I said some truthful things, and I probably shouldn't have said them. I probably talk way too much, but y'all know me, that's what I do. And I came to the realization that I was right. And that nobody really gives a flying shit about me and my biological family. And how everybody just plays dumb about the 40 years of my life that I've spent taking care of them and their children. And I'm just like, you know, when is it my turn? When do I get to go out and do what I want to do for me and pursue the dream and the career I want versus settling for all the shit that everybody else has given me and... My worth to my family simply falls into this category. I have a baby. You're going to watch it. I'm going to make more babies. And I'm not going to give you the credit that you deserve while I'm making more money than you. And babies. And not only did you watch us, but now you're watching our kids because we don't want to take responsibility for that shit. And it hurts me deep down inside that I'm the bad guy when I bring it up. Because no one seems to see it from my point of view. Which is the point of this video. Point of view and perspective is everything. And you know, I could be telling you the truth. And you can either take it as the truth. Or from where you stand, I'll be the bad guy. Which is okay. But it's not accurate and it's not fair and it's not right. When you sit back and you watch your sibling who has hopes and dreams get thrown out the window so that you can succeed. But then you don't do anything to contribute to your sibling's success. I want you guys to think on that so that if you're putting your sibling through some shit, especially if it's your older sibling and they had to take care of you and you keep fucking up and now they have to take care of your kids too because you won't grow up or take the initiative of making their life better by growing up and taking care of the responsibilities that you brought into this world. Think about that before you pass judgment on people's situation and their lives because you don't know what someone else has gone through. You don't know what else someone else is going through at the moment that you are talking to them. Because most of us, most of us cry in the shower. 